Greenville County 1% sales tax is stepped closer to becoming reality tonight. The plan is heading to the November ballot. Our Nate Stanley was at the Greenville County Council meeting. He joins us now with what tonight's vote means for you, Nate. Right now, the choice to accept the penny sales tax is in the hands of voters. You can expect to see this as a ballot item when you hit your polling place this November. Horrible. Flat tires. <laughs> a lot of them, nails in my tires. Um, <laughs> just bumpy, just, just needs very... to be fixed. Roads needing repair. It's the motivation behind Greenville County's proposed transportation 1% sales tax hike. Project Sales Tax Act, Title 4, Chapter 10. County Council passed the measure Tuesday with an 8-4 to four final vote. What we've been able to do just with the budget and just with our road maintenance fee has really been just minimal. And the, the need is so much greater. The ability to really repair um, and, and fix the bigger needs um, really can only be accomplished through a single source revenue fund. And I think the penny will really go a very long way. The tax would charge an extra penny for every dollar spent on purchases, not including groceries, medicine, and gasoline, and did receive some pushback. We never want to give government more money because we see government is always wasteful. There's a better ways to do things. First of all, we need to use the budget we have. We don't have an income problem in Greenville County. We have a spending problem. Voters will now be able to make the decision for themselves in November. I think a penny extra wouldn't kill me, so I'd be okay with that as long as... I was sure that they would use it for what they're saying they're using it for. They're consistently doing construction and it's not really going anywhere at this point. So why would y'all raise the taxes Absolutely. to complete a job that still hasn't been fixed <laughs> in so many years? And a reminder that Election Day is on November 5th this year. Reporting in Greenville, Nate Stanley, WIFF News 4.